Oh, just the burrata. It's like melted throughout. I love the crunch of the crust. I'm gonna have to get another one of these. This one's amazing. What's up everyone, this is David Hoffman from David's Been Here with my boy Todd the Traveling Clat. Yo, yo. And we're here in the Brickell Financial District in my hometown of Miami, his hometown as well. And today we're gonna eat some delicious pizzas here at Mr. O1. This place is like a contemporary modern pizzeria. We're gonna try five pizzas. What are you most excited about? They have a Nutella pizza on the menu and for someone with a crazy sweet tooth like me, Oh, it's gonna be great. I know, I love Nutella as well, so I can't wait for that. But I'm super excited for the star pizza. It's literally shaped like a star. Are we gonna hit the stars? We're gonna hit the stars. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go inside and eat some pizzas. I'll show you. All right, so here we go, here we go. We got five pizzas, but we're gonna start actually with one of my favorite things from Italy in the world. Have you ever had this before? No, I don't think so. So this is a, a cheese board or like cold cuts board. This is prosciutto and this is burrata cheese. Very like soft cheese. It's it's better than mozzarella. It's better than mozzarella. Yeah, yeah, it's better. What is that? Yeah. It's like a focaccia. A focaccia. Focaccia. So here we go. Break this. Look at this. Oh. See it pops. Oh. <laughs> so you get some of that. Put on the bread. Get a little bit of this, and there you go, my friend. It's cool. It's cool. Yeah. I like how messy it looks already. Is it good? Now let me try a little. You can try it with the cheese. Just scoop it out like this. And the reason there's so much noise because they're building a building in front of us called Brickle Flat Iron. A lot of concrete trucks passing by right now. All right, guys, here we go. Bro, oh, like butter. Oh wow. Oh, it's so good, right? Yeah. Oh. It's, oh my goodness. I know it's too much. I gotta throw the prosciutto on top. I love oh my it. goodness. That's next level right there. That is next level. Oh my god. It's so fresh. It's like a milky. Yeah. Fall apart. Yeah. Mm. That is, that's a, what a way to start off the meal. That's fantastic. I think we have to give it a sec because we have five pieces to go. Yeah. We have five pizzas. We have a Star Luca, which is a star shaped pizza. We have Marco, Coffee Paolo, Claudio, and Nutella. And I think we're gonna start with the coffee paolo, which actually has coffee in it. Coffee. That sounds crazy. Mozzarella, gorgonzola, blue cheese, natural honey, coffee, spice, salami, the bread. No big deal at all. Okay, so here we go. Let's let's just dive in here. Wow. Coffee pizza. I would have never imagined. Welcome okay. to Miami, baby. Yeah, I know, right? Cheers, bro. Cheers, bro. What in the world? The, the coffee with the honey is ridiculous. It's weird, but it's nice. I think the the honey with the coffee is a great mix in here. The contrast with the spicy salami. And it's very flatbread too, which makes it, you can intake all those flavors together at the same time. And it's not like too much. It's not overpowered by the dough. Mm, I love it. And the blue cheese, if you like blue cheese. Oh yeah. This game. Mm. What a unique pizza. I don't think I've ever tasted a pizza something like this. This is crazy. It's so amazing, right? Yeah. I'm super happy they gave us this one. Oh. This is my favorite. Favorite? We're only on number one. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, that is bizarre. Right? That is a crazy pizza. <laughs> Pretty part of your bizarre food. That could, honestly, it could be. All right, so the second one we're going for is the Claudio. Claudio. It's an Italian name, Claudio. What is this one, David? This one, let me see. This one is mozzarella. Fresh burrata, trattatella cheese. So the burrata we had before, like just all throughout. And then we have truffle oil. Oh, that's my favorite. Truffle oil? Truffle oil. I love it. You, you like truffle oil? Oh, I love truffle oil. Oh my god, it's great. All right, let's do this. Okay. Oh, this one looks so good. Oh my god, do you smell that truffle oil? It's so oh my god, in there. That aroma is ridiculous. <laughs> Ready? Right, we're going in? Here we go. Oh my god. Dude, this is like Italy right here. Wow. Truffle oil, burrata cheese, amazing pizza. Oh, and it's light. That creaminess. Oh my goodness. 
Oh, this is almost like a almost a plain pizza in a way. Yeah. Think about it. I love the way that this this bread just falls apart. Pizza. For me, that way that truffle oil is sitting in like the back of my throat after every bite. Mm -hmm. It just makes the whole experience so much more like truffly. It's like eating I don't know truffle fries or when somebody puts truffle oil on a burger. Exactly. It just kind of sits there with you and it's so good. And if you want more, you just dip it in here. Oh yeah. <laughs> Fantastic, dude, I love this one. Oh, just the burrata. It's like melted throughout. Another crunch of the crust. I'm gonna have to get another one of these. This one's amazing. The Claudio. Next, that one was fantastic. Yeah, that like, was really good. Man, the hard thing is that we have five pizzas and if we have five slices, that's a lot of pizza. Yeah. That's like each of us eating a whole pizza. <laughs> so we're drinking water, not beer. <laughs> Well, if we were drinking beer right now, I'd be tapping out already. All right, so the next one's called the Marco. The Marco pizza. Marco, Marco, questo è Marco. <laughs> eh, questo ce l'ha. What eh, we got here? Pomodoro. Eh, parmigiano. Che più? <laughs> eh, burrata. Arugula. E eh, già, basta. <laughs> You guys don't know I speak Italian. I didn't know he spoke Italian until today too. <laughs> I did not know that, dude. Listen, James, go, go eat Italian food when David's been here. The Italian side comes out. <laughs> yeah, give me some grappas and limoncello and everything else will come out. <laughs> <laughs> Can we just talk about presentation real quick? Because the colors on this. Yeah, you were I saying. I love it. It's the flag of Italy right here. Yeah. For some reason, I've been getting used to like folding the pizza. Oh yeah, it's the best way to eat it. Because there's no other way and everything falls off. Oh, look at that. All right, here we go. Oh my God, ready. There's another bomb. So, mm. the Parmesan with the salsa della burrata, dude, great blend here. First of all, burrata cheese is I'm, I'm falling in love from today. But this one, I, I'm just so surprised by how distinctly different every single one of these pizzas has been. Totally different. Wildly different. I mean, just changing the cheese to a blue cheese, throwing truffle oil, the honey. The honey is a crazy aspect to a, to a pizza, wow. like throwing honey on top. Mm. Wow. Mm. And those vegetables are so fresh. Mm -hmm. The arugula. And I love the shaves of Parmesan on top. Ah. Feel good? Wow, bro. Oh. This is something about pizza. That's the thing about Italy. The pizza in Italy is amazing everywhere. I know, I know, I saw some of your videos and Napoli and stuff. But he went to Chicago, and the Chicago pizza looked out of this world. I can't even believe it. But once again, this is what I love about eating pizza. I have so much fun making pizza videos, is because pizza is so radically different everywhere you go. And then this pizza at this restaurant is like radically different in every single piece and every slice that they give us. It's just so different. I won't lie, I'm full, cool, but. Next. <laughs> so now we have the star of the show, and it's a star pizza. <laughs> star <laughs> Luca. <laughs> wow, so what is this? Okay. Oh my god. So it's a star shaped pizza. It's filled with ricotta cheese, spicy salami, mozzarella, and San Marzano sauce. And I think what they did here is they put like into the crust and they fold it on top. Wow. Is this cut? I'm so excited for this one. <laughs> I know, I know. This is, this, is the, this is the best one. Look at those just pockets of mozzarella cheese. Is it mozzarella or ricotta? I can't even tell. I think ricotta is throughout and then mozzarella on top? I think I think so. I think this is it's, maybe it's ricotta. It could be that ricotta. could be ricotta and mozzarella throughout? Yeah. It has both. Alright. Well David, what are you doing to me? Are this is ready? too much today. <laughs> you wanted to do pizza. <laughs> No, I love pizza too, man. Oh yeah, dude, I can, I can eat this all day. It's actually funny, I haven't done a pizza video. Wow, look how that cuts. I know, right? What a fun... I love it. It's like, look at that. All right, bro, this is a big time right here. Let's do it. Do it. Mm. Mm. That spice salami, man. I'm good in that spice. That ricotta. So, it is ricotta in the crust. Oh, wow. Damn, pretty spicy this one. But that cheese, oh, that little, that layer of the ricotta cheese, it's so fluffy. Oh, it's amazing. This is the best part, right here. Wow. Oh. This one definitely has to be the star of the show. It is, is a star. mind blowing. This is hands down the most pizza, you know, classic pizza flavored one. You know, most standard yeah. pizza. 
but that pocket of ricotta cheese gives you such a different twist and then the little spice that's tingling throughout yeah you know from the salami oh it's so good i haven't had a salami that spicy before because yeah. like the whole thing is like a spice it's so good oh i mean i would love to have another piece but we have another star of the show which is the nutella pizza <laughs> bye bye diet no more diet for today <laughs> <laughs> no more diet. I, I haven't been on a diet in like 10 years. <laughs> this one's insane, dude. This, my my daughter would love this one. Yeah, it's gonna break up a little bit. You're gonna need a small one, tiny one. Yeah, yeah. I'll take the tiny. Yeah, one. yeah. I'm gonna get a tiny one too. Uh, okay. Oh my god. Wow. It's so soft, this one too. They make like a very fluffy dough here. I love how they put Nutella on it and then took it a step above by putting powdered sugar on top of the Nutella. As <laughs> if it wasn't sweet enough. <laughs> <They had to. laughs> Alright, here we go. Cheers, dude. Here we go. It feels like I just put a spoon of Nutella in my mouth. Well, this takes me back to my childhood. When I was growing up, we'd eat this every day. Wow, I'm overwhelmed by the amount of Nutella that's in here. Oh my god. The powdered sugar. It's gonna pop in my face. If you're looking for like a sugar bomb, I don't think it gets any better than this. I think they use like half a jar of Nutella on this one pizza. Yep. Wow. I feel like I didn't get enough Nutella though. Oh, I got enough Nutella. <laughs> Mm. There's not much to say, it's pretty simple, but effective. This is the best dessert of all time. Yeah. Another piece? No, I'm okay. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Five incredible pieces. <sighs> what was your favorite? I think I gotta say that this one was my favorite, just because okay. I'm a fan of like a classic margarita pizza, and this was kind of the closest thing to it, but adding that little bit of spice, because I love spicy food, and that ricotta cheese, because I love ricotta cheese, made it just off the hook for me. I also think that was amazing, but I gotta say, the first one we tried, which is the coffee paolo, I just love the honey with the spice and the coffee taste. So we're gonna repeat on these, but, <laughs> but yeah, guys, I hope you love this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up, leave me a comment below, subscribe to the Traveling Clat. I'm a pizza boy. Subscribe to the pizza boy. <laughs> and subscribe to my channel for more awesome travel content. I'll see you on the next travel adventure. Like, too good. I love it. <laughs>